Hi, we're here outside of Court of Queen's Bench, a special place for Royal Prince Albert ahead of the big day out the wedding. I'm here with our reporters Charlene Tebbett and Tyler Marr. Tyler, the atmosphere in Prince Albert, the excitement or the interest about the big royal wedding, what's it like? W waning, you know, I went oh. out on the streets today and spoke to a few people. Not a lot of people are going to be getting up uh, quite early to be watching this. A few said that they might, you know, PVR it, maybe watch some highlights on the news. But I would say that, you know, it's not uh, definitely not of utmost priority for a lot of folks right now. I don't know from the article you'd be writing for PNL, some people said, what wedding? What time? What? A lot of people said uh, they didn't even really know who was getting married. So, you know, we'll, we'll kind of see how that works out here. <laughs> However, Charlene Tebbit is finding out otherwise. People are interested, Charlene. There are some people who are interested. Uh, we did speak to one fellow in town whose mother is uh, has asked him to set the, the recorder to record the event. She's getting up at 2 in the morning to get ready to see the show tomorrow and the big day. Um, we spoke to another couple who recently moved here from England. Um, and they're going to, uh, to watch it. They said back home. It's just a frenzy there in England. People, a lot of people are really excited. And uh, as this lady said, she really wants to see the dress. She wants to see Megan's dress. Okay. I don't. Um, just in terms, Tyler, in terms of the history of Prince Albert, there is, of course, a royal connection, is there not? A little bit of a tie. Uh, yeah, you know, uh, the city here is named after uh, Queen Victoria's husband, Prince okay. Albert, right? So that's... Uh, but, sadly, despite our royal name, not a lot of royal fever, though, here in the city, it seems. And, Charlene, we have had royal visits here. Yes, we have. Uh, Princess Margaret, I'm told, came here in about 1958 to uh, to open the National Park at, at that time. And King George was here in uh, 1939, I believe. Whether you're watching the wedding or not, we'd like to hear from you. We've got a poll question as well as all our articles on PANow.com.